Hey guys, what's up? I've, it's been a really long time since I've done an update. Hello! Come on, do say. Do say. <laughs> he, he seems to like my jellyfish I got. But anyway, um... Hey guys, it's been a really long time since I've updated a video of my fish tank. Uh, I didn't have one for a very long time. And then, decided to get back into fish again. Out of all my original fish, uh... Is he in the, No, he's in that one. My bumblebee, which is the only fish I have for my original tank that's still alive, is in there. I have uh, some type of mad tom in there. I'm not even sure what type. Really big algae eater. I used to have like 30 of these albino quarries, and I got rid of all of them before. Uh, I think I have one female and three males left. Or no, two fem. Wow, okay, never mind. I have more than what I thought. <laughs> anyway, uh, and then I got a whole bunch of these different types of mollies. Uh, I'm not sure which types they are, but I've learned lately that they're not as hard to, or that they're very easy fish to breed. So I'm hoping to try to learn how to breed them. I'm really hoping because that'd be really cool to just fill my tank up that way and stuff. Um, I used to have a whole bunch of salamanders, uh, and sadly, almost all of them got eaten by some, uh, by some fish I had. Uh, I didn't realize they were going to kill my salamanders. Uh, only one is still alive, and he is never visible. He's always hidden in this grass, this fake grass I have. You are just following me everywhere, aren't you? Gee, you must really be hungry. I haven't fed him yet tonight. <clears throat> but, uh, but yeah, I have, I have some lace cats. He's hidden, like, right right over on this side. You may see him move a little. They don't come out a lot. Sorry, my, my mollies are really all up in the shot. They like all the attention. Uh, but, yeah, I'm hoping hoping my mollies may uh, have some zanios and I don't even know what the heck those things are. Some type of fancy minnow, I think. Uh, I have calico plecos somewhere. Those things are pretty cool. I don't I don't see any right now. They may be hanging out by the filter. I just turned or not the filter, the uh, heater. It gets really cold in the basement I live in, so I turned up the heater some more cuz their water's starting to get too cold. Uh cuz I don't want my plecos to to die of, you know, freezing to death. <clears throat> and I know that Molly's like a little bit warmer temperature. Uh but yeah, I don't know if any of my mollies are pregnant. I've had them for like six months, and none of them, of what I know of, have had babies. But I have a few, quite a few males, uh, and quite a few females. So I don't know if maybe because I have too many males or what. But uh, but yeah. Um. Nothing really. <sighs> Sorry. Nothing really all that special. Um. Uh, just same old, same old, life is life. Oh, I have one beta. Oh yeah, I forgot. I forgot to show you my beta. Yeah, that, uh, he doesn't have a name yet. Um, even though I've had him for like half a year now. Uh, or something like that. That's, that's my life plant. That plant was only about like, that big when I got it and finally it bloomed out. I'm hoping I can keep it blooming. I need to rebury it. It looks like it's, looks like it's, uh, unburying itself. I'll probably do that after the video. Uh, black sand, I got tired of, well, there is still gravel on the very bottom to use as a filler, but dang, you guys are really hungry. Uh, I've been having to thin out their food availability because I don't barely have any food left and I didn't have enough money to buy them more food. Uh, so I have, uh, so I have to get them more food. Yeah, he, uh, he needs a name. Uh, he's a pretty cool fish. But yeah, um, if anyone can give me tips on breeding, uh, mollies, that'd be pretty cool. Um, I've looked up a shit ton of videos and stuff, but no one really has a clear video or a clear picture of what a pregnant molly looks like. They just keep describing it, and I'm really bad at getting you know, information that way. I'm, I'm better at seeing it than I am hearing a description of it. Uh, but I have like some, I have like some of my females 
that are, or I don't think any of them are over here, like that one, uh, her, she, uh, she's a little dark, yeah, I don't know, some of them are starting to hang out in the plants more, I tried breeding the quarries and that was a total not success, that's why I got rid of almost all of them, I have a panda quarry, he's hidden back there between the two, two albinos, yeah, that's my, that's one of the albino females, the other one's an albino male, albino uh, male, yeah, this thing was infested with snails, I got like five snails, and the guy told me, yeah, that they would breed quite a bit, but not enough that they literally took over my whole tank, and killed, like, that plant was almost completely gone, like, the leaves were all just like, nothing almost, and so I squished, oh look, look, that's a, that's my, uh, normal quarry, my spotted quarry, he's pretty cool, I forgot he was in here, oh, there's, there's, well, okay, oh, see, there's one of the lace catfish, huh, he's pretty cool, uh, I traded all the, like, 13 albino quarries that I had, uh, I traded them for three of those guys, which to me was a pretty good deal, because I'd been wanting those guys forever. But yeah, um, I got these jellyfish from, like, way over somewhere, and they came in, they're pretty awesome, I got that from way over somewhere too, but anyway, yeah, uh, 